Hello and welcome to this video about one of the most fascinating topics of our time. In this video, we will explore the ins and outs of a subject that has captured the imagination of millions of people around the world. Chester W. Nimitz, an illustrious American naval officer, a name that echoes through the annals of history as one of the greatest naval commanders in the United States, was born in Fredericksburg, Texas, on February 24, 1885. The Nimitz family was no stranger to military service, with his father and grandfather serving in the American Civil War, making it a well-entrenched tradition for the family. After graduating from the United States Naval Academy in 1905, Nimitz set off on a path that would take him across the world, serving on various ships and being posted in a multitude of regions like the Philippines, Panama, and China. As Nimitz's career progressed, he took up the role of an instructor at the Naval Academy, where he taught engineering and tactics, and also served as an executive officer on the battleship U.S. Ohio in 1912. His career trajectory took a significant turn in 1941 when he was appointed Commander-in-Chief Pacific Fleet in the aftermath of the attack on Pearl Harbor. In this position, Nimitz was responsible for leading the U.S. Navy's efforts in the Pacific theater of the war, a Herculean task that required great acumen and strategic vision. Under Nimitz's leadership, the U.S. Navy mounted a series of counterattacks that shifted the balance of power and decisively turned the tide of the war in favor of the United States. These victories, including the infamous Battle of Midway, stand testimony to Nimitz's strategic brilliance and his exceptional ability to work collaboratively with other military leaders. Nimitz's calm and composed demeanor, coupled with his exceptional listening skills, further bolstered his reputation as a military mastermind. After the conclusion of World War II, Nimitz continued to serve in the Navy, holding various leadership positions before retiring in 1947. Despite his retirement, Nimitz remained an active and vocal advocate for the development of nuclear-powered submarines, which he believed would be a game-changer in the U.S. Navy's future. Throughout his career, Nimitz received numerous accolades, including the Navy Cross, the Distinguished Service Medal, and the Presidential Medal of Freedom, in recognition of his contributions to the Navy and the United States. In honor of his unwavering commitment and outstanding service to the nation, the U.S. Navy named a nuclear-powered aircraft carrier after Nimitz in 1964, which remains in active service to this day. Chester W. Nimitz passed away on February 20, 1966, at the age of 80. Today, he is fondly remembered as one of the greatest naval commanders in U.S. history, a true legend whose legacy continues to inspire the generations that follow. Thank you for watching this video, and we hope you found it informative and engaging. If you enjoy this content, Please consider subscribing to our channel to stay up to date with all our latest videos. And as always, don't forget to hit the like button and leave a comment below with your thoughts and opinions. Until next time, take care and stay curious.